Do we get another call? Okay. Hey, it's me, Looker. Apologize for the option, but could you... Okay, yes. Okay, back. Back to the place. Back to the place. Zoink. Oh, what's up, big man? Thank you so much. I need only three minutes only. Emma is in my mind. Recently. She has been running off somewhere on her own and often. I was hoping to ask her to watch the office for me today and once again, nowhere to be found. It seems that she did not return to me last night. Her friends from the former gang seem to be on the straight and narrow, so I hope this is not anything bad, but... What is this, a holocaster clip? Alright, chapter four. Got a message from the holocaster. We bring you a special bulletin. La late last night, an intruder broke into the museum and damaged a painting. Museum steps that the security is very tight and breaking into the museum is impossible. The culprit remains at large. Did you see that, David? When trouble goes, looker must follow. I'm on my way to the museum to begin my investigation. Uh... Okay. Alright. Alright. To the museum we go. All right, let's head inside and let's see what we can do here. Listen to this. You've got some timing picking today to, of all days to come to the museum. Or are you here because you heard about what happened? Someone went and left some crazy graffiti on a piece of the third floor. Some kind of depraved criminal, I guess. Sabotaging historic and valuable artwork. You know, this place is supposed to have the secret security. I wonder how criminal will get access. Head to the top floor and you can see the outrage. Believe me, it's unbelievable. The museum's director's up there too. Maybe he can tell you more. Bro. Are they gonna make me pay? Oh my. Oh my god, they're making me pay to get in. You absolute scumbags. I'm over here trying to like help you out and you make me pay to get in? Oh lord bless your soul. I hope something bad happens to him. Alright. Where? Oh, here it is. I am the museum director. May I ask you a question, young man? When you behold this graffiti, what feelings rise up within you? Do you feel that the value of this glorious work of art has been affected? Does it seem too to be sullied? Yeah, why not? Yes, I understand that. That would be a common opinion, would it not? Defacing a historical piece of graffiti, defacing the history embodied by this great work of art, consider the effort and pain of the artist. Let us simply profane and have this cheated so savagely. The problem is what to do now. Trying to store the original may worsen the damage. I think we will have to leave it as is until we can decide it. I suppose if the news brings curious citizens like yourself to the doors, there's something of a silver lining, but who could be responsible for the shocking work? I don't know. We have another special bulletin. Pokeball thefts are rampant in the city. The thief strikes directly after Pokemon battles and trainers let their guard down. These crimes are thought to be a work of a single individual, but the reports on the suspect's features vary greatly, so authorities are struggling to identify him. These crimes are occurring in back alleys and other places where people, uh, residents of the city, should exercise caution. Okay, so the alleys of the north is where we... So he's talking in this game. In this... Late looker, which can I return to the looker? Sure, dude. Fine. Okay, so we have to go to the northern alleys. So Alright. Well, look at that. We got a message in the holocaster. Looks like you've arrived at the back alley. Um, yeah, apparently the dude is hiding in here somewhere. Excuse me, perhaps. If you have a moment, how about a little battle with me? Sure. Let's do the battle. By the suspicious woman. Set. Sneasel to 40. I think Sneasel actually is going to evolve after this then. I think. No. Volk. Hey, that's a cool Pokemon. 
I love to see Volcarona. Hit it with a Surf. Man, I wish I could get a Volcarona. I would like al almost definitely use it if I could grab it, but I don't think I can get it without straight up trading from a different game. At least from what I'm aware of. Ancient Power? Sure, you can learn Ancient Power. Let's get rid of Takedown. How wonderfully strong. And some money. Oh, okay. Eevee is evolving, but we actually... No, I'm clicking no! Okay, good, good, good. I'm like, whew. I'm going to have to stick it back in the thing until we get to nighttime. Oh, you have some wonderfully strong Pokemon. I wonder, young man, if you won't consider giving them all to me. Stop right there. Obstruction detected. Process jeopardized. Relocating hunting ground. What am I doing? It's not the time to stand around being shocked. In fact, this is time to dash off. Chase is on. Now consider the direction. Um. Okay. Okay, so we need to go to another alley. That's okay. Fair enough. So we're just going to chase people all around the city, I guess, huh? First, I need to get rid of Eevee. Oh, actually, you know what I can just... No, actually, yes. I need to get rid of Eevee. Because I don't feel like stopping its evolution every single time. Hey, another alley. Another cutscene. Looks like you re... Um... Okay, whatever. Okay, so just go in and... Uh, there's so many useless talking portions. Hi, you're a trainer. How about a battle? Sure. You're challenged by a suspicious child. Alright. He 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 he. Wow, Mr. Chaney, your Pokemon are super strong. I wish I had a Pokemon like that. Not today, you crook. I will not allow it. And he's gone. Okay. Time to go to the other alley. Very intriguing gameplay you got here. Very intriguing. Very cultivating. Very. Alright, we're at this alley. Another message probably telling me absolutely nothing. This is pain in my chest. This is what a broken heart feels like. What has happened to you? It was over in a flash. I was training here in the alley when an enchanting young lady challenged me to a battle, and then she she do she utterly destroyed me. My heart was stolen by okay, and then she took his pokeballs. Okay. Okay. Now we must head over to the south. Final alleyway. Another holocaster. Probably gonna tell me, hey, you should get in there, huh? Cool. Thanks, game. For the absolutely boringest post-game side quest I've probably ever experienced in my life. Sure. Bite me. I'd... Sure. Suspicious lady. Who's only got a Persian. Again, don't know why I'm fighting you, or what's going on with anything, including what the museum has to do with this. For sure. Wonderful, I want that Pokeball. Well, you can't get it. You really do have some of the best Pokemon, so why not give up already and hand them over to me? No, I want them. I like my Pokeballs. Relinquish every Pokemon you possess. Cooperate or I will take them by force. Freeze. Pokemon Thief, I will not you lay your finger on my partner. Do not obstruct me, I will eradicate you. Easy words, but not so easy to carry out. Even though I the Great Looker have no Pokemon, I have yet my fists. I'm a train expert, the outlook for you is dismal. Mimi, why? Mimi trying to fight. Mimi, that woman is dangerous. Move away from her at once. This creature, I do not understand its process. 
How can this be? Why would our Mimi act so friendly to? It can't be so. Obstruction. Eradicate obstruction. Well, that wasn't very nice. Why do you protect this Pokemon? I do not understand your process. Relevant. Commence eradication procedure. Wait, stop this. Em Emma? That's right, you, you are Emma, is it not so? Mimi hates all adults. The only person that loves enough to make it jump for joy is you, Emma. I am not Emma. I am Essentia. You cannot deceive me, Emma. You may trick an ordinary human eye. You can never fake the bond between you and Mimi. What is the matter with you, Emma? Why do you do these things? If you are in some sort of trouble, could you not have shared it with me? Emma, say something. Emma, what's wrong? That's not very good. See, now, plot's get juicy. Must continue. Must discontinue. Whoa. David, forgive me. It seems that the last hit got to me. Do you think you could possibly help me back to the office? Okay. Thank you for your kindness, David. You have helped save me again. Even the looker can be taken down, as you can see. The injury to my stomach, a mere trifle, not at all. Cough, cough, pain. I may just pop by the hospital. Good. Mimi, could you give this to David? I'm about to embark on a dangerous investigation. I must ensure upon this road alone. In order to preserve you all from harm, I will claim to be staying in the hospital and use this chance to slip away. My injuries may be worse than I guess, but I must press on. I can't let this slow me down. I know without a doubt that she is Emma. The suit she wears is most likely doing of that man, the man I have come so far to hunt down. If I fail to find and stop him, my, my Emma might have no choice but to beg to the help of that despicable. Okay, so now, can we... Do we go here and get another hollow clip? Predictable, as this game is. David, um, it's me, Emma. I received this hollow... Uh, so I thought I'd check. I have something I want to ask you. Please come to the Looker Bureau when we... Okay. Yes, back, back to the place that we keep going back to on and on again. Hey... He actually showed up. Hey, I was hoping to find Mr. Looker. I've been so busy lately that I've hardly ever hear anyone. Do you have an idea where he is? Well, he's in the hospital. What's wrong with him? Now I'm even more worried than before, but I need more money to get into the hospital. Oh, is that the time? I'm going to be late. I got to go. Maybe we'll talk later. Please pardon my intrusion, but I, I might be just that this is the Looker... Would you allow me to verify your strength? Sure. Okay, apparently we're just fighting a random dude. Alright, Butler Calmers with a single Pokemon, which is the Braviary. Okay. Well, that is a very cool Pokemon. It won't survive very long. Zap. I see. Yes, as I suspected, your abilities and strength are without peer. You've, I, a former admin of Team Claire, have no chance against you. Please forgive me for testing you. I'm a mere servant sent here by the order of my mistress. She told me to measure your skill and to proceed only if I, fight, if I judge you are able. Oh goodness, look at the time. My mistress is not a patient woman. She has waited me too long. The consequence will be severe. You must hurry to the Hotel Royal Suite at once. Okay, final chapter. Okay, so now we need to go, I think, to the hotel. Is that correct? Apparently, I think we need to go over to the fifth floor. And actually, I don't think I've ever been inside the hotel, which is funny. It seems like I've spent ages inside of this stupid sound, but never been to the hotel. Very, very thick pillar, indeed. Alright, where am I 
going. Um, I don't think this is the guy. Yeah, that is definitely not the guy that I'm looking for here. Over here, maybe? Yes. One of the Leap 4. Took you long enough, David. It may happen that I need of your services, but I expect you to keep in mind how valuable my time is. Oh, okay. Um, he has the fighter. Alright. And just a single pyroid. Okay. Is that... That's it? Sure. Well, we can fight you. I will just end the whole thing in a single move, but... Fair enough, I guess. And we even got a crit, which is hilarious. Huh. Enough for now. I brought you here for a reason. The first issue is the identity of the trainer called Essentia. In truth, she is simply a young girl called Emma, wearing a piece of special technology dubbed the Expansion Suit. The Expansion Suit was created by Dr. X. I can see that the name means something to you. You remember him, I take it. One of Team Flare's scientists. That brings me to my request. The young man, make sure X disappears. I don't care how. If you need a reason, call it honor among thieves. Even we in Team Flare had our sense of pride. He may have disagreed with us, but we were doing what we thought was right. I won't let him sully our honor now. The hero of Kalos would hardly wish for that girl Emma to keep staining her hands with these crimes. If you want to help the girl, you need to put a stop to X and that I can help you with. If we leave now, we should find him at the cafe. Don't dwaddle. Be ready to face death if you go. Prepare well if you have a shot at surviving. Alright. Then we gotta go to the lab. Hi, aren't you speedy one? Score one for you. I do so hate to be kept waiting. Come on, I'll show you the way. Ooh, secret, secret. You'll find X in the lab. It's a secret floor that only certain admins know about. You'll need to take the elevator. I'll just enter the special password. Now you have access to the secret floor. You should find X. I rest leave to you. And you should keep in mind what will happen if he doesn't do the same. Okay. Weird, but okay. Alright. Hidden floor. Alright, let's do this. And is this... He said it was a copy of it? Hmm, who goes there? Who are you? What business do you have here? Alright, it feels like we got a few... Couple people to fight. Actually, we got a lot of people to fight. Oh, we have a lot, a lot of people to fight. Okay. Alright, well then, let's do it. Okay, so they said that it was the same layout, no? And we've gone through it once. So I should be able to just remember where to go. Although we'll probably have to fight a few more people again. Also, this was very lazy of uh, Game Freak to do this. Um, the fact that she literally said, Oh, you've already gone through this. We're, it's By the way, it's a completely different floor. Exact same puzzle. I'm very much sure they did not do this to like, oh, you've already done this, you know, but I'm almost 100% sure they just didn't feel like making a whole new level, so they're like, yeah, I'll just make it the same, the, the, the stupid children who play this game won't know the difference. Like, why would you make this the exact same? That makes no sense, other than if you're trying to cut back on costs or save time. 
But, whatever. It's not my place to judge. Well, actually, it is my place to judge, considering I'm a consumer, but yeah, you all know what I mean. I, I was just here, like, a little while ago. I should remember this. Unless, w this was the open way last time, right? Let me see. Fight. So, where does that take me? Is, th is this the one that I needed to get to the other guy? Another scientist. The strength, it's suspect. No, it's... I'm just better. Okay, this is probably the one that needs to take us to the right place. Yep. Okay. If it ain't David, what's cooking? Here, that's your line. Oh, well, I got a part-time job as a security guard. See, I'm a goddess in with the boss of, boss of here, but I don't know what they... Uh, ain't. How about we have a little battle? Sure, whatever, man. Just shut up and start fighting. Nyx. Oh, we already fought Nyx once. Doesn't... Nyx is hot garbage, bro. Why are we fighting this guy again? Fair enough. Ugh, you're seriously strong. Yeah, that's yeah, for sure. Well, mm, that's... Uh, but I still got a long grant to my ship tens, you know? Here, I better do Come here a sec. Okay. Here we... Nobody's supposed to be allowed in, you know? Makes you think there's bound to be something epic locked up in there. Stands to reason. I ain't got nothing going on at the moment, so let's us have a little look see for stacks of treasure. Okay. Oh, just random people's Pokeballs, huh? Wonder what Pokemon are in them. Where am I supposed to be looking? Oh. Dude. Oh. Okay. So, whatever suit Emma's wearing is actually taking control of her. Okay. Interesting. So, an average trainer into a superhuman force... Okay, I'm guessing that test subject is Emma. Okay. So, okay, so they tested Emma. They tailored the suit to Emma. And her new name is Essentia. Okay. Volume 3. Has no experience as a Pokemon trainer. Okay. So the Pokemon just want to play with her and they don't want to fight. cable I've called the Pokeball Jack then she collects Pokeballs from the trainer she defeats so that we may use them in our tests the results of the tests have been quite favorable okay so a quick friends of Emma have been proving hindrance so they lost control of Emma for just one second okay so when Emma is in the suit, she can't actually feel or remember anything. So that's an interesting thing to note. Okay, so there's one that we missed somewhere. Okay, number four. This is the one we missed. Because so I tested her physically. Okay. Okay. So there's just Pokeballs. Those Pokeballs got to belong to somebody, stands to reason. I promised Mr. Looker, and once more I meant it. I won't ever take Pokeballs that aren't mine. Whoop. 
my shift's finally ending. I'm out. See ya later, bruv. But sure and shut the place when you go, David. Okay, and I can't take these Pokeballs with me? Okay, well, and if you guys wanted to read any of that, just pause the video and read the stuff. Because, man, that's a lot of reading. Huh. Why did the remote control malfunction only that one time? Did he, what? Do I need to do more than simply put her in a state of sleep? Must I subdue her spirit too? No, no. Doing that would put far too great strain upon Emma's mind. Oh, you're the boy from the glitch trial. You've been interfering with my research very well. You will be the next subject for my trial. If Essentia can defeat you in the expansion suit, that is all the proof necessary to show that my research has been correct from the start. Come, Essentia. Now battle. Okay. Pokeball Jack function initiated. Virus potency set to 60%. Okay. Oh, that's a cool little sprite you got there. Alright, what Pokemon you got? Jellicent. Okay, we're gonna have to fight her a couple times, it seems. Okay. Astonishing. More than satisfactory, but skills go far beyond this. Now, battle. Alright. Pokeball set to 70%. Alright. Is she using those Pokeballs that she stole? Are these the Pokemon that were in those Pokeballs? Interesting. Brine. No, you do not need Brine. You're fine. Still silent, but another 8k. Yoink. Wonderful. Okay, we fight again. 80%. Okay, only one Pokemon this time, just a Persian. Just the one Persian, that's it? Alright. Level 66. Let's go and hit it with a Surf. Alright, another 9k. Easy. Alright. Fatigue as long as she wears expansion suit now battle. Alright, what? That is enough. What? Who are you two? Why are you here? Mimi is a psychic type. It is only natural that it could find the friend whom it opened its heart. You can't just barge into a private residence like this. This is a crime. That may have been true had we forced our way onto the property. However, all we did was step inside a wide open elevator. Now without standing that. Also, that does not hold up in Cory. Well, it was open. David is the partner of a great looker. We are in trouble. I would follow to the highest heights and fathom depths. Grr. Well, still, you will not capture me. Go get them all. It's useless. You feel nothing. You Emma cannot hear you. The one in control of Essentia is not Emma, but me. Okay. Is the Isn't the power of science amazing? There's no way she'll hear you now. It's glitching out. Uh. <laughs> she be glitching. Oh, how can this be happening? Not a problem though. Watch this. Remote control function set to maximum output. Stop Emma for me. Okay, look, I'll just do all the dirty work then, huh? Alright. One more fight. Let's do it. I think she's got two Pokemon. Crobat. I like Crobat, but not going to be alive for very long. Zap. And last Pokemon, Malamar. Level 70 Malamar. That is quite a Pokemon you got there, bud. I love Malamar. Malamar was one of the ones I went in into the Elite Force, so definitely a big fan of Malamar. I also think the Aurora might evolve. Ugh, okay, she's in pain. That's not very good. There are no more Pokeballs. You must stop fighting, Emma. No, Emma, what can I do? 
Remote control, power down, deactivate. Emma, are you alright? All I did was turn off the remote control capability. There was never any danger to the girl. What? Hmm? Oh, Dr. X, are we all done for today? Yes, my girl, we're done. You did a good job, Emma. The trials are now complete. I'm afraid your job is all over. Oh, really? Then I guess I've got to start looking for a new job again. Wait, why is everyone here? I thought it was a secret that I was working here. Emma, are you alright? What do you mean? I've just been taking a nap. My job here was really easy. All I had to do was wear this suit while I snoozed away. What are you doing here, Mr. Looker? I thought you were in the hospital. Oh, no. You see, I got a uh, special permission to check myself out of the hospital. I had to make sure you were okay, Emma. I had to see you, so I found out where you worked and came to find you. Oh, I see. I was afraid you might be mad because I started working without telling you. I kept their secret all this time. You really are a great detective, aren't you, Mr. Looker? You found me anyway. Naturally. Now, Emma, how about you go and get some dinner? I need to have a little grown-up talk with Dr. X here. Oh, sure. No problem. We'll head out now. All right. Let's all go together, Mimi, and you too, David. I guess we're dipping. It may be, but I think it's time you and I have a little chat, Dr. X. Of course. Why would I mind having a chat with you, Looker, or your soul apparently called? Let's get down to it. I would like to straighten this out before Emma returns, Dr. X. Could you please confirm one small thing for me? The criminal mastermind behind all these incidents was you yourself? Oh, right enough. The graffiti in art museum and the theft of the trainer's Pokeballs. All me. Controlling a sensio remotely with an expansion suit. Emma was clinically unconscious in the suit. Her mind had no clue what her body was doing. She has zero responsibility for any of the crimes. You'd no need to doubt her. That's how it is. If you're apprehending anyone, it should be me alone. Let's say I believe your statements. Emma's a fine person. She may be a bit foolish, but she's strong and a clear in purpose. It is required when one dedicates oneself to a single pursuit, clarity of the heart, and the purpose is needed if... So my research to succeed, the expansion suit that I dreamed of could only be created thanks to the clear dedication of the girl's heart. When you add that up, it means that I have no regrets. Take me away, officer. I hear you. Once I have everything in order, I will ask you to accompany me to the station, and that is all that I have to say to you as the looker of the International Police. What I say to you now, I say as simply Mr. Looker, young Emma's guardian. What you care to stay and visit would you care to stay and visit a while longer with emma and me she seems to have grown quite fond of you you know we we're about to have dinner together she was hoping you would join us i would like to wait until tomorrow after she has enjoyed a last year for night before i must tell her the truth look or whatever your truly name is your soft words are unexpected but not appreciated thanks okay um so, oh wait, let me see first I have a hollow. Yeah, I saw it. Once you leave, you always have one. Can you hear me? It's me, Emma. I have a crippled news for you, so please come to the looker. Alright, we're on to the final chapter. Let's do it. One more part of the puzzle. Finally, David, it took you so long. Guess what? Mr. Looker is getting out of the hospital, finally. I wanted us all to be here to welcome him home. Oh, you're back. Come on, Mimi. You're part of the welcome party, too. What's wrong? I think it's holding something. A letter. It's from Mr. Looker, David. I'll read it out loud, okay? To my dearest friends, I must have but a moment of your time. It is I, the great detective Looker. I write today because there is something I must confess to you. This is confidential top secret. I am not a private detective at all, but an officer of the International Police... You're shocked, of course. My hard-boiled detective act is brilliantly flawless, after all. But I know you have been worrying about my long hospital stay and the strange illness that kept me here. The truth is, I am the very picture of health. My hospital stay was a ruse to keep you all out of harm's way. My tensions were only the best, but it was still a lie, for which I humbly apologize. However, my friends, there is another reason for this letter, and so I must request of you just a minute or two more. I came to this region for an investigation. Detective Looker was on the case. And indeed, thanks to yours truly, the case is now closed. My greatness prevailed, I cheer, and yet... It also means my time in Callus is done. I must say goodbye to this lovely region and more painfully to you, my friends. Thank you all for your assistance. P.S. David, my colleague, you have been the perfect partner for all that you have done for me. Our time together, I would like to present you with my cherished codename Looker. And for Emma and Mimi, the two of you, I leave the Looker Bureau. I purchased the whole building, so never again will I have to worry about rent. It is now yours to do with as you will. Is he joking? What is this international police? He wouldn't go away and leave us, would he? Why? Could he leave without even saying a word to us? It can't be. He can't go. I don't want him to go off somewhere without us. He can't have gotten far yet, right? David, I'm going after him. S 
How's it going, David? I was bored, so I came over. When I was coming in, Emma was tearing out in a hurry. Something happened? Yeah, dude. Now you're gonna go up and leave too. He came all the way here to visit. Why you all gotta be so cold like that? And even though when I just ran into him, he said he had to go to the museum and totally blew me off without another word. Okay, well, that's clearly where we need to go. So to the museum we go. To talk to someone that'll tell us where he went. Is it someone down here? Oh. Oh, you're the same kid who came before to see the mural. The criminal response is caught. Did you know I hover the director of the talking with? What do you think? So when he walked out of here. Okay, well, either way, I know where I need to go. The Lissandre Cafe. Um, he's with Looker at the cafe. <laughs> okay, that's so stupid, though. Alrighty. The Lissandre Cafe we go. I'm telling you, I gave them back, every last one of them. You really say that you returned all the Pokeballs that Essentia stole, and I did, I returned them, and I'm turning myself in without a fight, so just give me a minute. There's no minute to give, our train is about to depart. Here they come. What, David, why are you here? Because I contacted Emma, of course. I'm sure she'll be here any minute now, too. Wait, where is he? Hold on, wait for me, Mr. Looker. Good timing, Emma. Dr. X, thanks for your messaging. Mr. Looker, I've been searching everywhere for you. Please tell me why, please. Why did you lie to us? Why are you leaving us behind? I'm sorry, Emma, but my letter explains everything. I work for the International Police. I'm a globe-trotting fighting elite. Wherever there is a case, I must go. Justice awaits. Then take me and Mimi with you. We'll join whatever police. We can be police or anything. If only we can just stay together. Emma, I wish it could be like that. You can't come. It's not possible at all. Why not? Why can't we? I'm part of the Looker Bureau, too. I'm your assistant, aren't I? In fact, the time has come for you to graduate from being my assistant. As of this moment, I name you the new head of the Looker Bureau. Listen to me, Emma. You were born and raised in this fair city. Every day of your life you have been here. You're the only one who knows this city inside and out. No one else could do the things you do for it. I pass my torch of brilliance detectiving to you. Take my place and keep protecting the peace of the city. But that's not fair. Come on, David. Say something. Tell him he's wrong. Emma, please. I must ask you to respect the necessity of my decision. David understands perfectly why I must go. It is the way of partners. He is my partner and we understand each other. Please don't take a sad face on my account. No matter where I go, our bonds will never change. You will be my dear friends from the Looker Bureau, always and forever. Yes, that it is bonds, a perpetuous notion which cannot be seen nor measured. And yet, I cannot deny that they do still exist. Fear not, Emma, for I suspect that you will always be tied to the international police by your bonds. Emma, I give you I give you my expansion suit. I have removed the remote control functionality, so you don't need to worry. As the new head detective in town, please use your powers as a sentient to protect your beloved city. And please take care of all the Pokemon that I raised for so long. They are yours they are yours now. I find it hard to see that as a kind person. I only became a trainer thanks to you being there for me. I will always cherish your Pokemon in your suit. I won't forget our bonds either. Everyone, I'm sorry, but we're nearly out of time. Our train is due to depart. Mr. Looker, I think I understand and I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to keep hard, keep working hard for you to help, okay? I will become the new head of the Looker Bureau. I leave it in your hands, Emma. I'll rest easy knowing you're on the case. Emma, don't you mess this up, my girl. And trust you three, the, the great task of protecting the peace of the city. Thanks for everything. Farewell, my friends. Thank you, and goodbye. That's enough. Hey Mimi, you know, we've made a lot of really good friends since we left the alleys. Those two old guys really did everything for us. Do you think that's what it's like to have a father? Oh, that's so sad. Nothing, never mind. Of course you wouldn't know any better than me, 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 but I'm still glad. I'm glad we got to meet them. Our story together ends here, but their story is just beginning. Okay, and I think that is the end of that. Unless we receive another hollow clip. No, no hollow clip. Alright, we've escaped hollow clip hell. But I think now we can return and we can fight her, I think. How are you doing? We've got no cases. I was thinking of going for a walk, but what if... Sure. Thank you. Um, okay. So I think usually I can, like, come back here and fight her. 
So I think also now I have access to this place, which is the sushi place. I don't... Hey, the restaurant is selected for VIPs. A little greenhorn like you isn't welcome. Get on. I'll throw you up. If you don't like it, get... But... Okay, everybody. So, um, we'll... I think I have to wait a day to fight her and then go to the sushi place. So, I'm going to go ahead and end today's off this episode, guys. So, oh, this was such a long mission. But, honestly, I think it had a pretty good outcome. The first, like, three chapters were extremely annoying. The last two were pretty good. But, um, anyway, guys, I will see you guys next episode.